Before the start of the 2023 season, there will only be two pre-season tests, one in Malaysia from February 10th to 12th and one in Portugal from March 11th and 12th. There are just five days of official pre-season running allowed before the new campaign begins as it has been since 2021. Since the post-race one-day test in Valencia last November, the whole MotoGP grid won't come together until the Sepang test in February. In contrast to Formula 1 pre-season testing, both riders from each team will take to the track at the same time along with test riders when needed. During the test, riders will have access to a variety of motorcycles to test out various improvements. Augusto Fernandez, a Tech 3 Gas Gas rider, has already completed three days of testing in Sepang for newcomers and test riders. Although not all motorcycles had transponders throughout runs, Michel Pino of Ducati was the test's top runner throughout the three-day and official test. This winter, there are two tests separated by a month before the 2023 season, which kicks off on March 26th with Portuguese Grand Prix. On Friday, February 10th throughout Sunday, February 12th, the Malaysian Grand Prix site Sepang will host the first official three-day test. Two weeks after that, on Saturday, March 11th and Sunday, March 12th, there will be a two-day test in Portimao before the season starts. In 2023, there will be one day of in-season test following the San Marino Grand Prix in September on the Monday following the event and one day of running following the Valencia Grand Prix finale in November on a Tuesday. The most significant change to the technical regulation for the 2023 season is the outright prohibition of the front right height device that may be used during a lap. The regulation of a minimum front tyre pressure will also have a greater impact on racing this year and it may result in more collisions during the races. In 2022, front tyre pressures were being checked but some teams were breaking the restrictions due to ambiguity in the regulations. Sprint races will be the largest change for 2023 although they won't be tested during the pre-season testing. 